Okay, so I didn't lose sound after <clears throat> renaming the dot pulse folder. So here's something interesting. I have a zero byte unnamed text file in my home directory. What is that? Zero bytes, plain text in my home. I've never seen that before in my life. <laughs> Not that it matters. Okay, so my dot pulse is missing. Now it could be that's a socket that pulse is creating, and it's there. And it used to be in the dot pulse folder. I don't know. So I'm gonna I'm gonna do the C monkey thing because I'm I'm really wondering why it isn't working here. It was working at home, and I think that'll provide part of the answer. As I have so many small pieces of the answer, it's ridiculous. Ridiculous. But <laughs> it's always there's always a reason to move on and try to find an answer. This is what we do scientifically. You eliminate it, you narrow it, you isolate it. You consider what could be true, what might not be true. Try to debunk what you think could be true. Till you get something consistent. It may even look like you have something consistent, and you don't. So now here's my IQ quiz. What is the capital of the state of California? That must be Hollywood. <laughs> okay. No, Sacramento, obviously. Okay. Okay, I got sound. And this is SEMA. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, let's stop here. Pause. Pause, pause, pause. Okay, let's see how this game. Let's just see. Hold on. See, okay, so I got, so we got, there are, there's no song during the game, but there are game sounds in your introductory song, which is where I was at home, that's a conclusion that I had drawn at home, but this is, in this case, by deleting the dot .pulse audio folder in my home directory, and the question now is, did I delete my dot .java folder as well? What if I do both of those? And let's see if it's regenerated itself, the, the pulse directory, okay? So, so that view you hit files, show hidden files, and okay, uh, put it put in order so it makes sense. Uh, G H I okay, there's dot Java and there's dot pulse. They both exist. Okay, so let's just see if I can repeat that behavior by deleting both of these folders in CMonkey. Right? And the difference between CMonkey and Firefox may or may not be indicative that one is problematic or the other. Now, I could also install Opera, and that's a completely different code base, and see how that responds. Probably better than Sea Monkey, but for now I want to keep them close to see whether I could come up with a more useful answer than it's just Firefox, right? If I knew if I knew that the difference between the two, and patently I don't, because dem you know, demonstrably I don't, so maybe I should use Opera. But um, if I knew that the only difference was the fact that it was well, actually in this case I know the difference between Sea Monkey and Firefox. Is it well? I'll find out. I want to know whether if in C Monkey with both those directories deleted, that it'll respond in the same full function, full featured manner as Firefox. And this is the complete opposite result that I got than what I got at home. When I got at home, the result I got at home was um, okay. There it is. Okay, I got two C Monkeys now. The result I got at home was that Sea Monkey work seemed to work better. <laughs> Whoever's watching this must be bored to death. It, it, hopefully, this is interesting because you can kind of see. Yeah, you know, after you have different tests going on. You know, with this in, with that, using this, using that, with under this, or with this deleted, without that deleted, with, you know, then, then you can find out there's some, you know, kind of narrow it down or get a better idea of what's really happening. 
and maybe this maybe this will be a way, you know, kind of a way to teach in a way. This is more what I, I consider kind of like a scientific method. Okay, I got an introductory song. This is Sea Monkey. But I'm not getting the song during the game. Now, again, I'm cons I'm not consistently getting the song during the game with Firefox either. And evidently, deleting the dot pulse folder seems to help. Now what I'm going to do is I noticed it made a difference the other day when I um, just deleted the dot java folder. I left the dot pulse folder alone, but I just left, but I deleted the dot java folder that's on the home directory. And I noticed when I did that, sometimes I would get a more sound, complete version of this game. And I wonder if I leave it intact, but delete the pulse audio folder, if I can draw a conclusion as to exactly what kind of, not exactly, but if, if, if that makes it still makes an incremental difference. Okay, so I'm going to stop this. I'm going to leave the Java cache there, which seemed to be the kiss of death for sound, and I'm going to go to my home folder and delete the .pulse file. Move over to the trash. Get out of here. Okay. Now, and we use the same app, so I have something to compare with. Deleting the dot pulse folder doesn't <coughs> instantly render my sound gone, as far as I know. Let's try it. Okay, so it's probably been recreated as soon as sound tries to run. Question is, are the contents of that dot pulse folder becoming corrupted over time? Maybe, maybe not. Right? Um, maybe what was happening was the first time that I would. Run, I, I still don't know. I did it more than once. I can't just say it's the first time I ran it in Firefox that really was the pulse folder. It could be just some kind of combination of the contents of those two. Um, it's, it's still, it's a bit tedious to have to do. Every time you want to have sound. Aha. Okay. That's significant. So I've only deleted the .pulse folder, not the .java folder, in my home directory. And I got something that I couldn't get before. Now this is the C monkey. I'm going to go back to Firefox and see if that makes any difference. The original song is gone. Now another, of course, both Firefox and Sea Monkey keep their own cache, right? So let's see here. If I could go, where's privacy security? Um, Browser history, or there's gotta be a cache somewhere. There's the cache. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna clear my cache. So I noticed, I think I remember the first time I went into um, Balloon Bounce with. Yeah, the Sea Monkey so far, or was it Firefox? So far today, the actually the song was playing. You know, the usual song. Okay, so okay, uh, too many, too many variables. Okay, uh, let's see. Show hidden files. Let's go here. G G uh, J Pulse. Okay, I'm gonna delete that folder. Spacing out. Okay, then I'm going to go into preferences and I'm going to let's see advanced. Where's my cache? They moved everything around. I keep changing things. 
general content privacy. Here's my cache. So I'm going to clear that. So all I've done is cleared my cache and deleted the .pulse folder. And let's see if I get the full game here at Pogo with Firefox, the full sound. I'm going to stop. I don't want to lose this.